Hello, Louisa Jewell here. Today I did a workshop with 60 women leaders on how to go from burnout to balance. And I wanted to share one really important tool that can help you be more resilient and reduce stress. So let me start with a story. I was doing this workshop and I was super excited about it because I really want to work with this group. And so I really wanted to do a good job. And about a month before I was delivering the workshop, they reached out, the organizers reached out to me and said, hey, Louisa, listen, we don't think we're going to have a projector or a screen, you know, for you to use PowerPoints. Are you okay if there's no PowerPoints? Well, I have been doing workshops for 20 years and I always use PowerPoints. So if this is a really important workshop for me, I really want to do a good job and now I don't have PowerPoints, that was a little stressful for me. But I said, yeah, sure, that's no problem. I thought, I'll figure it out. Now, so the first thing that I did, and I did three things. The first thing I did was I called a friend. Now, we don't often call a friend because we often think that we are going to burden them or, you know, bother them in some way. But in fact, our friends really do want to hear from us if we need help. So I called my friend who's a really excellent facilitator. We facilitated together. I love her style. I said, hey, I'm going into this thing, 60 women, no PowerPoints. You know, what would you suggest? And she's like, ah, so even she thought, ah, that's a little stressful but she gave me some great tips. So that increased my confidence and reduced my stress because I had ideas on how to do it. The second thing I did is I had a new perspective. I took a new perspective. I thought to myself, you know, for years I've been saying that I'm kind of too attached to my PowerPoints. I didn't want to be so attached to my PowerPoints. And so I thought to myself, well, thank you universe for sending me an opportunity to learn something new, to try something different, to change it up. And that perspective, oftentimes if we look at something that happens as a threat, as opposed to a learning challenge, it can be more stressful. So instead of looking at these things that come our way, things that are unexpected, maybe things that we really didn't want to have happen, we can say, hmm, instead of it being a threat, I'm actually going to learn something new and it can be challenging and interesting. And the third thing I did was I actually used my VIA character strengths. Now, if you're not familiar with what VIA character strengths are, they are those parts of your personality that people love, respect, and admire. And they can energize you. And engaging your VIA character strengths can make you happier and more fulfilled. But also, VIA character strengths are what make you strong. So they actually boost your resilience when you're going through a difficult time. So with this challenge, what I did was I looked at my VIA character strengths and I said, which character strengths can really help me in this situation? And one of my top five character strengths is curiosity. So I got really curious, how can I make this really engaging even though I don't have PowerPoint slides? And then I thought, why don't I use the VIA character strengths? Why don't we do a VIA character strengths session? So I went back to the organizers and I said, hey, why don't we change this workshop up a little bit and use the VIA character strengths? And they said, we love VIA character strengths. Let's do it. And so I ended up doing it. Uh, the whole workshop went so well. People loved it. They got so much out of it. And so I took what could have been a stressful situation. I used those three strategies. Call a friend, shift your perspective, and number three, use your strengths to boost your resilience. And with all of those three things, I ended up having a great workshop and a great result. So I hope that helps you today. I hope if there's something going on in your life that has been unexpected, um, try using those three tools to help you be more resilient and boost your well-being as well. And reduce stress. Yes. All right. Thanks, everybody. See you next time.